What's up, friends of the good boy? This is Money, and welcome to a new video right here. My hawk robot in Titan Paradise. <laughs> so many titans that I can take down in this match, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to be absolutely insane. And if you want to see something other that's absolutely insane, by the way, instant win, kind of, right? Now, well, this is our beacon. It should be our beacon. Uh, but if I was on the other side, I would still have gotten that beacon first. You know that, right? From the instant win series, in the top right corner, you find the video where I am starting on this side over there where the enemy is, and I jump on this beacon in one jump from the enemy, from our base there, and uh, instantly make a win out of this match. In the top right corner is the video. And um, another video you find in the top right corner is... If you want to see something truly insane with a hawk, where I did 27 kills in one team deathmatch match. I literally went through 27 enemies and got the kills for that, right? Um, and it's just it's just insane. My team has barely gotten any kills and we won this, um, this match. Well, it was actually getting a little close near the end, but uh, we won it because I got 27 kills with just one hawk robot. Also in the top right corner for you guys, check out this video, you, you're gonna love it, I tell you this much. And I was having some vibes right there with some awesome music, dude, that was cool. So, before we go to the hawk, uh, I first have to use my Fenrir here. So, I'm gonna do my best job I can with this new Fenrir of mine that has the Nucleons and the Atomizers, right? And, uh, and then we're jumping into um, uh, into the uh, Hawk robot, and this will change everything. By the way, this is why I equipped these weapons to the, to the um, thing now. Because I can now do a lot of damage even at long range. Something I could not do with the shotguns before. It was incredibly good against all those Ravanas, the, uh, the Fenrir. Uh, but let's face it, if, any, if somebody was out of 200 meters range, I was barely able to do any damage anymore, right? And now with this, I can really, really take down people even at long range. And uh, I love how my enemy team has... The enemy team has e easily gotten our beacon in the middle. I don't know how this worked, but yeah. Boom. Did you see how quickly quickly that uh, Blitz robot went down? Let's see if we can do some damage here to this guy. Yep, look at this. Wow. Yep, that's the guy who was sniping me here before. And I finally took revenge. And I still have the Ravana... Uh, no, sorry, the, uh, the Fenrir at about 50%. Now they're taking the other home beacon. Oh my god, what is my team doing? What is my team doing? Why do we have four people here? I mean, I have my Fenrir. I have the F-bomb deployed. I don't need four people here with me. Why don't you just guys take care of the other beacons? I can't, I can't respawn this robot. It's perfectly in the overdrive range right now. And I'm doing immense amounts of damage. And you've seen what I've done so far. Let me just show you what I can do with this one Fenrir here still in this match before I get killed. You'll be insanely amazed to see how much I will be doing still with this thing. It would be really a waste to drop this thing and uh, look, this is a Ravana. He's getting absolutely super flattened while he's trying to shoot me with his cryos. And there goes down another Leech robot. These are like the strongest robots in the game. Leech, Ravana, boom, and I eat them for breakfast, dude. Like, whoop. Yummy. And one, one more is gone. Here comes another one. And... <laughs> it's like the, the sound of a cracker when you're like... <laughs> Alright, mine. Snacked. Here goes another one, man. There goes the Ravana. And... <laughs> Got him. And if you like the content, by the way, then subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And hit that notification bell, too, so you get notified. The next giveaway will no longer, will not be far away. And it's probably, hopefully, going to be 200 uh, Hawk Robots, right? So, um, it's not going to be far away if I can make this happen. No promises, but I hope this might be working. And thankfully, my team, by the way, has gotten the beacons back. I'm still here with... Uh, the night uh, with the Fenrir. Isn't it insane? I want to show you a specific topic. I want to show you how, how I use my uh, my Hawk in Titan Paradise. And I just don't get killed with this thing. It's insane. Um, but I will now because now the Titans are dropping in. So obviously I had to wait for Titans to drop in before I can be in Titan Paradise. And now that the Titans are here and I'm still snacking a couple of more meta robots, um, we're gonna be uh, getting killed by the next Titan relatively soon. And uh, yeah, right now, because they bypass my resistance and this is the moment when my Fenrir is death, dies. You, this is why I have to deploy the Fenrir first, so I have this great match with the Fenrir before the Titans are there. However, also obviously the Hawk could counter uh, my my Fenrir also very much and that is a problem for me um, 
But yeah, so, right now, ladies and gents, uh, we're gonna be here and uh, doing something with the enemy. We're starting... First off, I need to take some damage. Right now, there aren't that many Titans, but there will be. There will be Titans, and I will be in Titan Paradise. Boom. Alright, now, Overdrive is activated, at least for a short time. I want Overdrive to activate some more. So, I need to shoot these guys, and I can do a lot of damage to them, even at long range. That the only problem is their resistance. If they didn't have this ridiculously much resistance, those titans... Thanks for the target switch. I love it. So, I need to take some damage. That's why I'm walking into the open. I want to take some damage before I start to fly. Now, I'm first going for the leech because his leech ability is going to end. And then I'm going for the enemy titan. And look at this. Oh, man. The hawk is in titan paradise. <laughs> we have already two titans that we can slaughter right here. And I told you, I can do even tons of damage to enemy titans with those sniper weapons at long range. But f first, let's get this guy out of the way with his Aochun. Boom, got him. Nice. And we're walking back up. Now we have lost the exact correct amount of HP so that we no longer lose the overdrive, right? So we basically have double damage for the rest of the match until I get killed, pretty much. So let's see. Boom, boom, boom. Yep, see those shots are actually dealing dealing quite some damage to him. But I can't I don't think I can hit him very well right there. If I start to fly, he may he may just land. Let's see. Uh ooh! Ooh! Oh, I thought he was gonna land, dude. Titan Got him, Titan Slayer, and Titan, Titan Slayer, and look how many Ao Mings there still are, dude. It's so good. There's three more Ao, Ao Mings that I can eat up. That I can snack, dude. This is Oh, I'm in Titan Paradise with the perfect hawk. The hawk that has the outranges the Titan. I'm actually outranging this Titan right now. So he comes in. Look how much damage I already did to him. He's trying to fly closer to me because, um, you know, he wants to finally shoot me. He's trying to draw me back and I have my ability ready. So if he does get me in range, I'll be starting to fly. And I want the Titan to the right. I almost killed the entire Oming just with my sniper weapons now because of overdrive. There goes one guy and... Oh, I'm in Titan Paradise, dude. Let's finish him off with the sniper weapons all the way. Boom, boom, boom. I did another good 30% damage to him just with the sniper weapons here, man. This is just... Or 20, 25% or whatever. It's so crazy. Let's get in range. Right? We're getting suppressed and locked down by the, the thing here. I'm locked, but I got in range, so I can... Look how much damage I can do. I, I don't bypass his resistance, unfortunately, but he might, may not be fully maxed, and, um, yeah. Here goes, uh, almost goes an entire leech robot in one second, right? One second, he's almost destroyed. And he hides behind the corner the whole time there. And there's another titan, is it? Is it a titan? No, I think this is not a Titan. Okay, we were absolutely in absolute Titan paradise. And we'll jump into another match in a few seconds. Um, with the Hawk. Look at this damage. And this is why even Titans take a lot of damage. Because there's so much damage coming out of this thing. Um, and I don't even have those uh, Marques weapons. Uh, Mark, uh, Mark II. Yes, those are Marques weapons you get. Or Marquis. Marques, whatever you pronounce those. I know... I said Hussars in one of those recent videos. I'm an idiot, I know. Sorry for being so stupid sometimes. But I keep... I, I mean, I have not been using Marquis or Marques so much. Um, and this is probably why I still confuse those with Hussar a little bit. Um, Hussars are the medium ones, though. So yeah, 5.5 million damage, 15 kills, 2 beacons capped. Absolutely carry the heck out of this match. Let's jump into the next match, guys. Uh, where we use the hawk. Look, I, I actually produced a bug right here. I'm standing on the ground in walk mode and I'm still shooting my weapons. I was actually, I'm in the ability mode and, and my weapons look like they are out. But I still have the laser beam firing. It's because I got stuck at when I started to fly and then he, I touched the ground and so the robot came back with his legs and put his weapons back out. But the weapons were still not, you know, fireable. So they were hidden. Alright, so we know the drill. We need to get some damage so we get to do double damage ourselves, right? Overdrive rule. Let's go and uh, and de take damage. If we can. And by the way, I'm playing this Hawk so perfectly here in this Team Deathmatch match. You're gonna be seeing some amazing flight maneuvers. 
So, oh man, he's got the stealth thing. Okay. Did they make this? They made this longer. It's like four seconds now, I think, right? But has this even been in the patch notes that this is longer now? So, thankfully the scorpion has not jumped on me. Thankfully he jumped on something else. Because this would have been dangerous. So, yeah, I want to I want to take some damage so I'm exposing myself to enemy fire. Because now the overdrive is running. Look at the damage that this guy's taking. Look, this is a scorp scorpion, dude. He gets so demolished. He gets so demolished. It's insane. Alright, I'm taking more damage. Overdrive is yet again activated. Another scorpion? How many scorpions are there? This is the third scorpion I see now. And here we're doing double damage with the lasers. And I skillfully land back in safety every time. And you're gonna see some crazy flying later. Look, another scorpion here. That's the scorpion that just um, killed one of our guys. And he wants to cross to the right side. Let me show you what he's gonna do. This is gonna be so funny. Overdrive is activated. He thinks this is the good idea and the good time. And boom, 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 finish death. You don't get to the left side, uh, to the right side, buddy. Forget it. And here we have a Leo. Oh man, that feels shady. To snipe down a Leo in two hits from a distance. Look at that Nightingale standing there like a boss on the map at the end. What are you, man? Are you king on the map here? King of the hill? So yeah, um, shooting down this lagging Auchun, I would imagine, because he's not moving or whatever is happening, I don't know. Uh, got him down. And what do we have here? Oh, it's a Ravana. Okay. Uh, and the enemy titans will obviously spawn back in soon, so let's just wait for that to happen. Uh, okay, Auchun is flying. Maybe I can get him with a flight ability here, that is my plan. And I am. And up, down to last stand. And here comes the enemy Auchun who wants me. But I'm of course landing perfectly in safety. So that his flight ability is worthless. In the meantime, I'm even not just, not just I'm ignoring him, but I'm also killing another dude in the meantime. Or helping. And now look at this. I can out brawl this, uh, this brawler, no problem. Boom, 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 three shots and he's down to last stand. He comes out of last stand and you know what's gonna happen then. Boom, boom, boom. Finished. My goodness, is that insane. <laughs> uh oh, we're being, oh gosh, we're taking a lot of damage now. Uh, from the, from the, uh... Cryo Ravana that sent some rockets around the corner. Okay, I did some free damage here, corner shooting. Okay, now we're flying because the Auchun has made a strategic arrow with his flight, look. Uh, but I'm actually not even going for the Auchun. Did I get him down? And boom, killed the guy on top and I released the last stand on the other person. So it was all successful, I got the Griffin, I got the Nightingale on top of that roof. And I dropped the last stand down uh, on... Uh, on this guy right there with his Auchun. Now, um, and, and then of course, on top of that comes I landed in safety where nobody can get me. And I still have two heavy weapons, thankfully. Uh oh, a Fenrir. Wow. Look how much damage I can do to the Fenrir even with the laser weapons. Uh, no, okay, you know what, let's, let's bypass his resistance. And this is so sad, this is so sad to see this happen. Also the leech ability. Just bypassing everybody's resistance and then he thinks I'm gonna get killed now but my goodness look at that landing. Look at this landing in perfect safety right here dudes. That was a close one. One second uh, wrong flight or half a second and I wouldn't have made it back here into safety but I made it. Here we have this guy trying to sneak around the corner and boom. How many kills have I already gotten? How much damage have I done? This is insane. And now the enemy titans are spawning in. We have two Ao Mings. And you see where they spawn, right? They purposely spawned on the other side of the map. Brought down him down to last stand again with yet another Auchun. And they're very careful now. They, they don't want to attack. They even purposely spawned their titans on the other side of the map. So that they don't have to fight my um, my robot here. I knew, I knew this was a, le uh, a blitz robot. I thought as much. So I started using the... Uh, the thing here to bring him down doing some damage there and look they're both ready for me they want to take me down but they can't do that so easily because i'm kind of safe here and the blitz robot with his legendary pilot he would have been so dangerous to us but and uh, not with uh the resistance break we already killed three things we should not have been never have been able to kill because they have resistance Fenrir, leech and blitz 
I'm starting to fly, but unfortunately, this guy has really found a good spot right there. Look, I thought I was going to be able to get him here, but turns out he really found himself a really sweet spot where he can sit in absolute safety and even shoot me on top. So what I do here, I'm going to try and walk around the circle and bypass him from the other side. But he instantly started flying and uh, tried to get me here. That was crazy. But you know what? Now he came out of cover. So... This may not be the same per paradise of Titan Paradise as before, but it's still gonna be Titans, and now he knows he's gonna be toast. Bye bye, dude! Yep, that's it for you, man! Rips. And then doing some damage to him up there, too. Quite a bit of damage, actually, and now he gets killed because we have two Kid Titans underneath him. And he won't get any getting anywhere. Boom. Alright, so now the question is where is the next Titan? Again, guys, check out the videos that I've linked to you guys in the top right. I, I know you're going to love both of them. The Instant Win series is incredibly fun. And uh, this this 27 kill streak with this Titan right here was in was insane. You see Xap, Xap kick right there? Xap keep. Um, he already fought us a few times before. Or I killed... You remember, this was the guy with all those last standing Aochons. I don't know how many of his robots I've killed. But at this point, I know he's pretty mad at this hawk. Because guess what? All this, and it's still the same freaking hawk. The same gosh darn hawk that has been killing him so many times and taking so much damage into him. That takes him down again! His entire titan now. And he's like, come on, man. This thing just can't get killed. Because I'm playing it so careful right here. I'm playing it so incredibly careful. And, uh, yeah, so... <laughs> That's it, 30 versus 17. We almost gotten twice as many kills here in this team deathmatch match. And I'm, well, I would imagine I, I did at least 15 kills. Let's see how much that was. 15, I did 15. That was actually a, 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 by random chance. I didn't know that, I just guessed. Uh, I just guessed half of the kills of our team. And we even had uh, a, a guy completely missing. And I don't know how he did that. Normally, when you leave the game, you get replaced by another person. But he must have literally stood in the match for 40 seconds and then left. So that there's not even a chance for another person to fill his spot. Like, that sucks really, man. Todesbringer. There's an R missing. It's a German word. and Normally, there's an R behind it. The Deathbringer, that would be. So, yeah. Um, guys, thanks for watching this video. I hope you had some fun with my hawk in Titan Paradise. And see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.